I have not seen this clip yet. Just a disclaimer. I have not seen this clip. But once I saw the caption, I saw the picture, I saw what she was wearing. I was like, this has to be good. So let's take a listen. Let's take a listen. This is a, a live, raw reaction of this. No edits. Take me on our first date. You. If you dress like that, we're going to the crib first. And then we can do whatever after that. If, if Depending on how that goes. <sighs> I know you want me to get up there and lie to you. No, of course not. I don't like lies. Yeah. But, question. Mm -hmm. Why would you be taking me to your house? Shit, what you want to tell us No. B&B? No. <laughs> Shit, car set, like that too. Wait, oh my god, am I like selling sex to you? I mean, I just feel like you know, I look good, body look good, but it shouldn't. You make money. It shouldn't. Yeah, I make money. I'm a. You look real good. Right, like this is this is like walking beauty, but like you know, I have mad respect for myself. Where would you take me on the date? Is that your answer? After the crib. We can go get some food wherever you like. Where would you take me? I said wherever you like. I'm real like. Just whatever I want. Yeah. What if I want to go shopping? Damn. I'm gonna have to call somebody else. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so I'm just gonna have to decline. But you know, you got that shit on. You flat. I give him a thesis. Um, when I walk away. Uh, yeah. So we not keep ace? No, I'm not mm -hmm. keeping him. Walk slow, nah. <laughs> I'm gonna take me on our first date. You. She cannot be serious, dog. <laughs> she cannot be serious. There's no way. She's got to be trolling. Now, I got to see in this, this they, they, there's no way, there, there cannot be a defense of this. <laughs> I hope there is, like, even even the hoes cannot defend this. Even the even the 304s cannot defend this. I promise you. This, this Let me look at the comment section. <laughs> she said, she's selling delusion and I ain't even watched the clip. He said, ma'am, your ass was out. What what else should, you, <laughs> should he be expecting? A prayer? Like, yo, I'm literally looking, what is she wearing, dog? Her ass is out. <laughs> <laughs> ain't no way there's no way i mean look homie i don't i don't know how many times people got to tell you this you have to uh dress how you want to be addressed right that's the old-fashioned saying but it's it does it, does, it does, that it doesn't even need to be your 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 whole ass is out i i don't know what she i hope she's wearing i think yeah i think she's i think she's it's like a sagging it's so it's, it's almost like she's sagging her pants for that for that for the butt cheeks to flop out and then on top of that with like some kind of bathing suit type top on i i mean i don't know what kind of fashion is that but this okay let me let me let me give it to you real i didn't seen girls right they go to certain clubs or in my case i've seen girls go to strip clubs okay and They'll go to the strip clubs and because these young girls, they don't really have guidance or most a lot of their mothers were 304s or they or their mothers were 304s in the past. So if they wore like a 304 prom dress, they just went they just thought, oh, this is this, this is what this is what I got to wear to certain events. So you'll have a girl. They'll go to a strip club and then they'll tell the dude or in my case, me, me, they'll tell me. this. They'll they'll look at the dresses that the hookers or the strippers in the in the in the club or the strip club, and they'll be like, "Oh, they're they're wearing what I'm wearing," and I'm literally I literally got to look at him like this. No, you're. <laughs> I'm just like, no, you're wearing what they are wearing. <laughs> you have their attire on, not the other way around. <laughs> Nah, man, it's it's like I don't like a lot, especially uh the newer generation of girls. They don't realize a lot of the clothes that they are wearing is li it's hooker attire. It's not even it's not even stripper attire. It's just hooker, straight hooker attire. This is something that you would see a pro. Uh, when when I mean a pro, let me keep it blunt. A sex worker. This is what uh a street worker would wear in like Rodeo Drive in L.A. or whatever sketchy neighborhood in um. <laughs> Bridgeport, Connecticut, right? <laughs> this is what they would wear to advertise themselves to potential buyers. But unfortunately, the line is um how do I how do I say this? The line is the line is blurred, right? The line the line is blurred between um how, how do, the the line is blurred, meaning 
you you cannot tell who's the street workers from the regular girl because they're all wearing the same clothes and mostly it's the normie girls wearing stripper slash hooker hooker attire because it get it garners attention from men so whatever's going to garner attention from men whether it be positive or negative attention they're going to wear it just for the attention in the past what you had in like roman empire times whatever you'd have certain girls they would wear blonde uh blonde hair or their dyed hair blonde whatever whatever blonde extensions whatever they had in the past and those were the hookers that's what the hookers would wear right to get their customers but the normie girls were jealous at the hookers because they were getting attention from their men or the man that they wanted to get. So they started wearing their hair blonde. So this is how this stuff works. So let me replay the video one more time. I'll do a little step by step analysis. Hopefully you saw the video in the beginning, just in case if you don't want to hear me on that end. So let's bring this video up again, because this is this is hilarious. Now, this there's no way because I'm watching. I'm looking at the comments. Nobody's defending. her. <laughs> nobody's defending her. He said, she said, ma'am, your ass was out. She said, I mean, look at how she presented herself. <laughs> I'm not even, uh, and mind you, notice, I didn't even address what the man said yet because it's obvious what he's going to ask for. Oh, you, you, you selling. <laughs> it's, it's, well, there's, there's, I don't want nobody as saying this man is an a-hole. A a now it helps that the man is a, a bit of a Tyrone. So that helps. <laughs> so that helps. This helps my case in, in, in this, in, in this case, but not much needs to be said. If you dress like that, we're going to the crib first. And then we can do whatever after that. Now, to be, and also, he was very honest. And look what happens when he was honest. He got rejected. Now, this is what, what, what usually happens. You see how quickly he made his decision about her? Really? That's how most men, how quickly men make their decision. And one of the biggest indicators of or uh, biggest uh uh catalyst of this decision is how you are dressing <laughs> now if you're dressed like a hooker literally is like okay or sometimes just the way a woman talks then a guy will be well he'll just make that split the decision in his head like oh okay let me just let me just get what i need from this girl and get out of here now he's not they're not going to be honest about it they're just going to kind of string you along but that's your your position is that position unless if you prove otherwise it, depending on how that goes <sighs> like she got mad at this answer but clearly she has heard this before and clearly no no one is being honest with her like yo the way that you dress is affecting the reactions or the requests that you get from other men i know you want me to go up and lie to you no of course not i don't like liars cap <laughs> that's cap but question mm -hmm. why would you be taking me to your house Shit, what's wrong with your hotel or something? No. B&B? No. <laughs> Shit, car set, like that too. Wait, oh my god, am I like selling sex to you? I mean, I just... Yes, you are. You are selling sex. <laughs> I mean... What What else? Dressing like that, do you think that the average man would want from you? Your brain? Some, uh, I mean, somebody in the comments section, I, I missed it. I, I missed it, it said you got... Little, you got literally hooker attire and a in a in a church wig on at the same time. It's crazy. I feel like you know I look good, body look good, but it shouldn't. She first of all, her body does not look good. She she's she's a bit overweight. To be fair, money. it shouldn't. Yeah, I make money. I'm a. You look real good. Right. Make money doing what? What what could she possibly? Well, you you'd be surprised because you'd be girls that be working like, you know, they be giving some of these three or fours these positions and. <laughs> you just, you'd be like, how did she even get that position? And that, never mind. Let's let's go. Let's keep going. Like this is this is like walking beauty. But like you know, I have mad respect for myself. Where would you take me on the date? Is that your answer? The crib. We can go get some food wherever you like. Where would you take me? I said wherever you like. I'm real like. Just whatever I want. Yeah. What if I want to go shopping? Damn, you gonna have to call somebody else. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so he was very honest, and this is the the beautiful thing about. The beautiful thing about the Chads and Tyrones, when they're being honest, they don't really get the the same critique. Say if I, as somebody like me, was being honest, so people cannot. So now, when he says it, it's beautiful because now I don't want nobody saying, "Oh, what's wrong with you?" <laughs> because it'll be like a regular dude will be like, "I mean, what what else do you want me to offer you?" And they will say that man is wrong, call him all types of names, or. I, I know this. This one girl, she keep talking about. Oh, you give me incel vibes. They only say they don't like. I, I, uh, this girl said that to me uh, recently. That I know somebody that I turned uh, 
uh, that I had turned down. And I think word got to her that I turned her down um, sexually because she ended up like not talking to me for a while until she wanted to talk to her mutual friend again, our, our mutual fr uh, friend again. But what's interesting is chat, when somebody looks like a chatter Tyrone or they talk like a chatter Tyrone or they would come up with a man with experience. And when they say the exact same things that we say, <laughs> they don't be they don't ever be saying, oh, you give me incel vibes. Like, cause what he's, what's beautiful about this, cause if he's, it's perfect that he says it because uh, let's, cause, because, cause if the average man says it, then we going to look like we crazy. It's going to have to decline, but you know, you got that shit on. And don't ever let a lady say that she wants honesty because she was completely honest. And she was like, and she was like, no, <laughs> now he could have got her. He, first of all, he could still get her. He could still get her. He could still smash, but he could have, I'm talking about easily smash if he, if he told her exactly what she wanted to hear and most guys in that position are going to tell her what she wants to hear and then this is why you have these women thinking they have options out here oh i, I could do this and blah 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 is because most of these guys are not being honest you know what i'm saying so shout out to him because he, he like whatever path he chose whether he was honest or whether he decided to play the game i would have let him go because clearly you have no self-awareness about yourself this is america if you're a fool, they don't. It, 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 uh, when people see a fool in America, they bump their head. It is what it is. You fly. I give them a thesis. Um, when I walk away. Uh, yeah. So we not keep an ace? No, I'm not keeping. Walk slow, Wait, I know that IG model. I know that. This is the. This is the. That ain't that. <laughs> I know. Wait, first of all, all right. Let me put it on me real quick. I know who this. I know who this is. I don't remember her IG handle. But this was the, this is the weird old girl. I know who that girl is. This is the weird old girl. Talk, I remember this girl was in um, around 2016. I think 2016 or 2017. I don't remember her IG handle. I don't feel like researching. I know, who, I know exactly who that is now. This was the IG girl that Michael Blackson was putting on her, <laughs> promoting, paying for low key, because he smashed clearly, but. She was promoting herself via Michael Blackson's platform, talking about she was 19 and I'm a virgin, but I got all these ass pics. And I'm like, stop capping. <laughs> and I'm like, first of all, she don't, I'm like, you not, you don't look 19. And if she is, that means she's been in the streets for all, I'm talking about for at least seven, eight to seven years. And I'm not exaggerating because I'm literally, because she looked exactly like that when she said she was 19. I'm not shitting you. I'm, I know, I know who that IG model is. I don't, I just don't remember the name and I do not feel like doing no research behind that 